Hello Harvey Zoners, today we'll be talking about something that some of you will find very interesting especially if you have an old PC at home That's right, today we'll be talking about how to upgrade your PC without breaking the bank Over here we have a system that's running on AMD2 Phantom 965 DVD-ROM 500GHz 4850 and a GX650 power supply Next we have a system that is running on Intel Core i5 4440 Fire Gate hard disk, 4GB RAM, and an Intel HD Graphics 4600. These components are not sufficient to run the latest games. To easily upgrade the system, all you have to do is get your hands on the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 750 Ti, which is one of the best value for money graphic cards you can buy today. It really sweeps voltage, so it does not require power connectors. This makes the card a perfect option if you are planning to upgrade. In 3D Mark, we got 4,124 for Intel system and 3,976 for AMD system, which is great. In Unigine Heaven, it score 1109 in Intel system and 822 for AMD system. While in Unigine Valley, it score 1709 in Intel system and 1359 for AMD system. Finally, in 3D Mark Vantage, it score 22066 for Intel system and 90,965 for AMD system showing that there's a good increase in performance In Bioshock Infinite, we got 110 frames per second for Intel system and 103 frames per second for AMD system In Grid 2, the system was able to run at 93 frames per second for Intel system and 82 frames per second for AMD system. In HMAX Solution, the game ran at 50 frames per second for Intel system and 45 frames per second for AMD system, which is more than playable. Finally, in Batman Arkham Origins, we saw the system running at an average of 87 frames per second for Intel system and 75 frames per second for AMD system. Okay, guys. That's all about it. Thank you for watching.